Hello, my name is Juliana Celestine. I will be doing my presentation on Cornelia Africanis. Quick disclosure, there is a chance I will be pronouncing several names incorrectly, but I will do my best to correct myself immediately. The exact birthday of Cornelia was estimated to be around 190 BC. Cornelia was the second daughter of Publius Carina Scipio Africanus, who was a hero of the Second Punic War, and her mother was Amelia Pulina. She was also recognized as a prototypical example of a virtuous Roman woman. Carilla married Tiberius Sopranus Garacci at the age of 17. She was able to bore him about 12 children, in which only three children survived. Their names was Tiberius, Garacius, also known as the Garacci brothers, and Sepora. Even after the death of her husband, Tiberius, Corinna decided to remain unmarried. However, there were suitors who sought for her hand in marriage, but she refused all of them. One of them was named King Ptolemy, the seventh of Egypt. He even asked for her to be his wife, but she would not take the crown that he offered. Instead, she devoted her life to her children. To reiterate from the previous slide, after the death of Corinna's husband, Tiberius, Corinna devoted her life to her children. Corinna hired the well-known Greek scholars Blasius of Cumini and the Fays of Mytilene to tutor her children. When it came to her son's careers, Corinna always supported her son's Tiberius and Gaius. She was also portrayed as being active during their political careers, especially during Gaius' reign. However, both were killed by conservative autocratic patrician senators. Tiberius died in 133 BC for his efforts at reforming land laws, while Gaius died in 121 BC due to an uprising orchestrated by his enemies in the Senate. After the violent deaths of her son Tiberius and Gaius, Carina retired from Rome to a villa in Minsa. After her death in 110 BC, a marble statue of Corinna was erected. However, only the base survived. It was said that her statue was destroyed during the revolutionary reign of Sulla. Later, the base of Corinna's statue was altered. During this time, the conservative attempts of later Roman reformers in which the base of her statue that gave reference to her famous sons were filed away. It was replaced with the inscriptions as daughter of Africanus rather than the mother of Garachi. The base can be found in Capitoline Museum in Rome. 